When we say Tesla, we mostly mean EVs and SpaceX that promise two-way trips to Mars a few years from now. But that is definitely not it, and Tesla aims to add a few more feathers in its proverbial cap before Elon Musk decides to ride into the sunset. After already proving himself by revolutionizing the transport sector with his Tesla electric cars and SpaceX's rockets, Elon Musk is now looking to embark on another audacious project which involves an all-electric plane that will be a game-changer for the aeronautical industry. Musk says that electric planes will be viable within the next five years, and his statements do seem to suggest that the company's R&D department is already working on a prototype. Green Air Travel is Tesla's next ambitious project. There are other companies that are also looking to change how we see the aeronautical industries right now. Of course, there are certainly some serious issues that need to be addressed before we even think about green air travel. Electric propulsion aircraft prototypes and programs are already underway. The likes of Siemens, Magnus Group, and the Harbor Air companies are already working tirelessly to create electric planes. In fact, Harbor Air has already taken a small step towards completing its mission after its 100% electric commercial aircraft made a three-minute flight that carries six passengers to Richmond, British Columbia. Air transport is one of the primary sources of CO2 emissions, producing 3% of the total emissions. One of the main reasons why Tesla has become so successful is its ability to produce luxury sedans that run on clean energy without compromising on performance. So in the spirit of sustainable development, we expect Tesla to eventually work on creating an electric plane before becoming a leader in the aeronautical industry. The DHC-2 aircraft is equipped with 750 horsepower electric motor and comes with a huge lithium battery system. The flight range is 160 kilometers, so we can treat this particular plane as a prototype. Now in order for a company like Harbor Air to finally be able to boast a plane that can go far and beyond, it needs to have better battery technology. So far, they haven't been able to tackle this particular situation. Right now, automotive technology allows lower densities. Tesla's lithium-ion technology gives you roughly 250 watts per kilogram, and though it can be optimized further, still has its limits. In order to reach 400 watts per kilogram, which is required for an electric plane, you need another technology, and this is where the game will change. The good folk at Tesla who are tasked with improving battery efficiency are now working on a new technology that can store 60% more energy per volume than lithium-ion cells. If they are able to perfect the technology, it will be a true game-changer. Anode-free lithium metal cells will have higher energy density, which will improve the range of electric vehicles by around 280 kilometers and even help get us closer to a fully electric urban aviation economy. This sounds all good, right? The only problem, or problems to be precise, are that these cells aren't very sturdy and have a short life cycle. But then again, let's not even be pessimistic about things, especially when we know how good Tesla is at finding a solution. While still trying to contain our excitement, we admit that even if the right charging technology is created, chances are that a Tesla Airbus won't be ruling the skies. The first aircraft will carry a handful of passengers. In recent years, more and more projects and startups aimed at electric aviation have emerged. This confirms that in the coming years, there will be a huge market for electric planes. Therefore, Tesla has to position itself to be an industry leader when the time comes. Back in 2015, Musk admitted that he already had a design in mind about the Tesla plane. A few years later, he revealed that he would like the plane to do a vertical takeoff and landing. In fact, Tesla believes that there is a real possibility of an electric plane that would not require a long runway as the current jets do. Before we comment further on Tesla's electric plane aspirations, let's have a quick look at how far other companies have come. Back in 2017, Eviation, an Israeli company specializing in electric planes, presented its first prototype at the Paris Air Show. After several years of work, the plane is ready for launch. Alice, the electric aircraft, is capable of carrying up to nine passengers and two crew members, with a payload of 2,500 pounds. It can reach 220 knots with a range of 440 nautical miles. The travel range is less than the company expected when the prototype was announced in 2017. Alice uses a high-energy density battery system that is based on cells currently in the market. Similarly, a Toulouse-based startup, Aura Aero, is expected to market its electric plane for regional transport from 2027. Keeping all these major developments in mind, Tesla will have its work cut out if it really aspires to become a leader in the new age of aeronautics. While they are already close to establishing something of hegemony in the EV sector, we cannot say for sure if they'll enjoy similar success. 
But then again, Tesla has always defied odds since its inception, so once Musk and his team start seriously working on creating an electric plane, chances are that they will breeze past their competitors who might be enjoying something of a head start right now, but don't have the resources or technological capabilities Tesla has. Nonetheless, we must say that the promise of a greener aviation economy is not just regular rambling any longer. The aeronautics sector is still light years away from reducing its environmental impact. At present, the storage capacity of the batteries is not sufficient enough to fly medium or long-haul aircraft. There has been some work done on introducing hybrid aircrafts that combine thermal and electric energy. At the moment, the industry's focus is on developing smaller electric planes, from single-seater planes with a few dozen seats. Coming back to Tesla's aspirations, it is true that Elon Musk wants to eventually have his own fleet of electric planes. However, the eccentric CEO maintains that manufacturing electric cars and improving them every year is important along with other verticals such as solar power and energy storage. This means that the talk of creating an electric plane is on the back burner and the company will probably get back to it when the time is right. But the very fact that Elon Musk talks about the electric plane every now and then makes us think that the idea is not abandoned. Who knows, he might even propose the project just like the Hyperloop by making his designs available to the public, organizing contests, and funding those who come up with innovative ideas. So far, we have no idea when Tesla will seriously start talking about its electric plane. Musk says that eventually, all means of transportation except for rockets will be electric. At the same time, the company is getting closer and closer to increasing battery capacity, so the moment they are able to hit the 400 watts per kilogram mark, you can expect Tesla to gradually start working on a prototype for the electric plane. More than that, the latest developments in battery technology will allow the company to reduce its battery cost, which will also have a good impact on car pricing, making them more affordable for potential customers. Once that is done, you can expect Tesla to swiftly move towards creating an electric plane prototype which might be unlike any other electric plane we've ever seen. Sort of like those quadcopters we saw in G.I. Joe. I'm so dying to do a supersonic electric VTOL jet, but adding some more work will make my brain go boom," wrote Musk on Twitter, thus showing that while he would eventually move towards this direction, now is not the time. So guys, just sit tight and wait for Tesla to clear off the items in their priority list first. The company knows that at present, they don't need to be worried about other companies that are trying to make inroads in electric aviation. Perhaps the reason why Tesla hasn't done much about an electric plane is that deep down, they know that once they are able to take care of the battery storage side of things, they will be perfectly placed to create a fully electric VTOL or vertical takeoff landing plane in a short span of time. Till then, Tesla is more than happy to let the others have a shot at it. Meanwhile, let's just enjoy the next few years of EV evolution and SpaceX trying to explore the new frontiers starting with a two-way journey to the Red Planet.